Okay, so we're going to talk about how to um, work with the project window, which for me is right down here at the bottom. For you, you might see it over here on the side, maybe over here on this side, depending on how you set it up. I think a lot of people will have it set up over here. In fact, that's where I'll put mine as well. Now, your project window is where you're going to see all the files that are in your project. Now, the, the technical term for that is assets, and you can even see this word assets right here. Um, I should start by saying that the project window might look a little bit different for you since you have an older version of Unity. Uh, this is a slightly newer version, which hopefully we'll upgrade to in the near future. But you're going to see your assets folder here. And whatever assets are in your project, that's what you'll see in this folder. So I don't have any assets in my project right now. First thing I'm going to do is just import some basic stuff. Now the assets menu up here will let me get to this import package menu, which is actually really important. So I can import any kind of assets I want, any images, any videos, any sounds, any 3D models that I need. But there are some custom, or sorry, there are some uh, pre-made packages that I can use, and they're available in this import package menu. So these are all the packages that are kind of built into Unity that I can just grab and use. So I'm going to import uh, terrain assets. That's a good place to start. So I've just imported them, and I get this window that asks me, hey, which ones do you want to import? Well, I'll just take them all. So I'll click import. Those are going to get added to my project. This may take a second depending on how many files they are and what kind they are and things like that. So now I have this standard assets folder. And if I open it up, there's terrain assets and a bunch of different terrain assets. And if I click on them, I can see what they are. So this is a preview of a texture. These are all different textures that I can use. Cliff, dirt, grass. Um, let me import another package. Let's go with skyboxes. So this time I'm importing skyboxes. And this is another different kind of asset. We'll let those import. Again, this may take a second, depending on uh, how many files are in that folder. So once this imports, there'll be another folder under Assets. Each time you import something, you're basically bringing it into the project window, and it'll be under Assets. So as soon as this finishes, I'll show you what that looks like. There we go. So now, under Standard Assets, I've got skyboxes and I've got terrain assets. So I can go in here and look at all my different skyboxes. There they are. So once these files are in the game, now I can use them in my game world. So for example, maybe I'll make some terrain. And then once I've got some terrain, I can put a, um, I can put a texture on it. So I'll use my terrain tools to add a texture. And normally there wouldn't be anything available here, but now I have all these textures available. So I'll go ahead and add that. I could also add a skybox, because I did add those skybox assets. So I'll go into my render settings. And I will pick a skybox. So maybe I'll take that and put it in there. Now I have a skybox. So putting those assets into your asset folder here lets you um, use them in your game. Basically, any file that's part of your game is going to be in that assets folder. And one way to import them is using this import package menu. So there are certain packages that are built into Unity, and you can get those easily using the import package menu. But you can also bring in custom assets, and there are a couple ways to do this. Um, so first of all, I'm just going to make this window a little bit smaller so that I can get access to my other files here. Because I'm going to get an asset. Let's say I want to grab an image. Uh, let's just go ahead and look at pictures and wallpaper. That looks good. Okay, here's a picture I might want to use. So the easiest way to get this picture into my assets folder is to just grab it, drag it right in. So it'll import. There it is, wireframe. And now I can use that in my game if I want to. So maybe I'll make a new thing here. Maybe I'll make like a, a plane. And then I can grab that asset. Where'd it go? And I can just put it right onto the plane as a texture. Okay, so you can do that with any t any image. You can just drag an image in and use it as a texture. Unity handles all the conversion for you. Um, so 
that's basically the process is just dragging files into here into your assets folder um, but I should mention that this assets folder is kind of interesting it's actually um, it's, it's where all the files in your project are stored and if I go ahead and right click on it and choose reveal in finder I'll see that there is actually an assets folder on my hard drive it's part of my valuable assets project and it has all the stuff in it that you can see in the project folder so new terrain asset standard assets skyboxes terrain assets this is all the same stuff that you're seeing in unity so if I go ahead and grab a file like here's a PHP file if I just drag that into my assets folder in the finder take a look at what appears in unity there it is so any file that I put into this folder will appear in unity any file that I put in unity will appear in that folder and that's how you add uh, assets to your project so now you guys go ahead and give it a shot